Morning, Rebels. It's morning. Let's talk about jealousy. It's 10% luck, 20% skill, 15% concentrated power of will, 5% pleasure, 50% pain, and 100% reason to remember the name. Hey everyone, somehow it is again Friday. Uh, I don't really know how that one happened. Uh, another week is over, and uh, here we are. And... We are talking about jealousy. Um, this is actually a topic that I, I know quite well, uh, and it's something I've been dealing with quite a bit over the last year or so. Um, and I have gotten a lot of advice on the subject, just as I'm sure you have. And what it comes down to is jealousy just sucks. You know, like, you can, you can take the high road and be like, everyone has their own path in life, and who am I to judge? you still kind of feel like shit when someone's doing better than you and you've been working really hard. Uh, so some of the things that have helped me uh, get over this is, A, a friend of mine said, and he's quoting someone if I don't know who, that every day you should do something that brings you closer to your goal. Um, so when I get really jealous of someone, I get really productive. That might explain why I've been doing so much work. And I find that if I'm really productive, even if I'm not, you know, being recognized for it, at the end of the day, I still feel pretty good. I would also recommend some form of changing topic. So if you're really jealous about writing, uh, I usually find that by doing something that doesn't relate to writing, something that's usually physical, like going out for a walk or picking up a new sport or hobby or something like that, generally helps. Uh, if you get really tied up in thinking that someone's doing better at something than you are, doing something completely different is often a really good way of getting over it and realizing like that's not actually all there is to life, and outside of that one specific area, everything else is pretty damn good. So change the subject. You know, just kind of get out of that. Um, this is why I do a lot of different things, because if I start feeling inferior in one thing, at least I can then pop over to something else and be like, oh, well... I might not have gotten, you know, a billion dollar book deal yet, yet, but at least I can hang upside down. And the uh, the third and final thing is actually something that I heard years ago uh, from a friend of mine, and she said that jealousy is a sign that you are getting close to your goal, and it's kind of true, I think. You know, if you're in a completely different area in your life, um, say that you're just starting out writing, jealousy isn't as strong as when you have finished writing and you have a book and you're querying or whatever and you're jealous of the people who have agents. You know, like, the closer you get to your goal, the stronger the jealousy gets of the people who have it. So if you're wicked jealous of someone, that just means you're actually really close to achieving what it is you want. Um, so, yeah. Like Gretchen said, jealousy doesn't have to be a bad thing. Uh, and uh, like everyone else said, it does still kind of suck. So how do you deal with jealousy?